Oh, oh, oh. Absolutely stunning spec. Yes, like it. In the glacier blue, absolutely amazing, man. You get to enjoy it. Wow. Crazy, 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 crazy. What's up my Snapchat media family? I hope you're all doing well. I hope everyone's all good. And um, it's an interesting morning for me. I'm sure you guys can see it's quite early. The time is currently 10 to 6. There's my uh, tape that everyone asks me about. But before I get into the tape, check this view out. Oh, I love Cape Town. Like I said, it's early. There's very little that can get me up this early. It's either I have to be on my motorbike or someone's mentioned car meetup, which is where I'm currently going to. I'm going to check out a little breakfast run. And because it's this early, I'm able to actually go and check it out. But yeah, like I was saying, my tape, I get a lot of questions about this. It's actually for days like this, man, when I'm filming. Um, you know, the sun reflects incorrectly onto my speedometer, then uh, I get a lot of glare. <laughs> I'm gonna say it like this, glare. <laughs> but uh, yeah, yeah, I'm sure you guys can put that one together. But um, besides the tape, I'm sure I'm not the only one that struggles with this. I've been trying to motivate myself to get up early, to do other things like exercise and, you know, just start the day earlier. And I just can't do it. But um, for days like this where someone mentions a car meet or a bike run, I swear I'm up at like 4 o'clock. I'm up an hour before the time, ready to go. Like I was actually sitting in my kit, just waiting for time to get closer to the meetup point, um, the meetup time. And um, I was like, man, why am I, why am I like this? Why can't I do this for other things? <laughs> oh, look at this view! Are you nuts? Okay, besides the cars and everything, this makes me very happy and excited. So so beautiful, man. We really live in such a beautiful city. Cape Town for the win, my people. Well, in some cases in this video, Mexico City for the win. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm on my way. Let's go check out what um, what's all coming to this meet. I'll take some videos for you guys. Oh, I'm so glad I'm talking. Usually I'm sending it through here. Woo! <laughs> I would have passed that guy and I would have just watched my mirror the whole time to see what happens next. But uh, yeah, let's get to that meet and I'm excited to see what's all going to show up. Stay tuned and enjoy the ride. <laughs> I did decide I'm going to do a little bit of car spotting on my way here. I just didn't expect to spot something so early and what a beauty to spot. I think this is the F360 Modena or Modena. I'm not sure how you pronounce it. But oh my goodness. Look at this. You see what's nice about when we're waking up early guys, you catch all these amazing stuff on the road, the roads are empty, um, it's peaceful, you get to enjoy it. Wow. <laughs> Absolutely stunning, we've got an F-type on the side here, the red roof, Porsche, another Porsche, I see this one often, I really like the colour. But, uh, wow, man, I'm actually gonna, st oh, the Mod Modena's pulling off. I have to turn around. 
Oh man, the uh, Ferrari pulled off. But I have to show you guys the front end. I actually turned around just to show you guys this. Are oh, you nuts? Oh, oh, oh. Absolute beauty, man. <laughs> what an absolute stunner. That takes me back to like Need for Speed. Like the first generation of Need for Speed that came out. Um, where those cars were seen as new at the time. But wow. I can't explain how excited I got to see that. Usually you see them parked in a dealership or something. But to see these cars on the road is just another type of experience. So if you're wondering why I live there, um, <laughs> one of my buddies stay within this vicinity. So um, I'm not sure who else does that. Pass a friend's house and you decide to just make some noise with the engine. Because they will be able to identify that it was you. So I'm sure I'm not the only one that does that. Okay, so I'm approaching the meetup spot. I can already see an M4. And I'm keen to see what else there is. Let's go check it out. M4, I see a CLK. This thing came past me earlier. Sounds really good. But uh, I'll give you guys a close-up in a moment. So, we've got some cars pulling up. I hear something. It looks like an Audi. Let's check what it is. It's coming in a moment, but we've got the M4 over there. There was this Rocco that pulled up ahead. I'm just waiting for buddies of mine to come through. But uh, let's hear if this Audi makes some noise again. Oh, sounding good. <laughs> Wow, that looked epic. Sounded so good as well. Love the wing on there. And I think he is coming back. But, um, oh, got a Porsche that's coming out of nowhere here. Love, oh, don't, oh, that looked painful. Oh. <laughs> I remember the days of worrying about scraping the lip on the Honda. But imagine the lip on a Porsche 718. Epic, epic. It's starting to look good, guys. It's starting to look good. Here comes this Audi again. <laughs> look at this thing, man. Absolutely stunning. Crazy, crazy, crazy. I love the wing on that. And uh, the all black look. They look really good together. Um, the Audi and the M4 the vehicle that I'm actually waiting for, a vehicle that's close to my heart in general, the E33 to 5IS. This example is impeccable, just look at it. Oh, there's old and new. Yes, like it. In the glacier blue, absolutely amazing, man. <laughs> this is my buddy. Um, I'm not sure, I've been waiting for him here on the side of the road. I don't know if any of you have ever pulled up to a car meet where you're waiting for someone and uh, everyone's there but you don't know anyone so you just chill until your familiar face arrives <laughs> but have a look at this thing impeccable one of the most amazing colors you can get it in it's original as well fine classic metal that's his page you must check out his other beauties and uh, yeah really such a stunning example everyone gets excited to see these um, not, not many people pull them out these days, but he at least takes them for a drive. Joining this run today, 
but the Toyota Yaris GR this is gonna be amazing through the pass and this is the Audi saw the Audi earlier look at the wing on this thing full carbon fiber wing like a mini R8 and uh, got the M4 my one of my favorite colors in the M4 between this and the Yas Marina blue nice 4 series <laughs> nice man got the Porsche over there I think everyone went to go full fuel in their cars 440i on that side we got the Sirocco Golf Arms yeah it's gonna be good fun I think the guys are gonna enjoy themselves and I'm gonna film I'm not gonna do this whole run with them but um, I'm gonna ride along and see what footage I can get of the vehicles 2 series coming sounds like a 235 or 240i so far the two the the B58s have been coming through okay that is and someone's alarm gave in I'm trying to see who's the victim <laughs> that happens often with the the BMs in the underground parkings this has happened on the public road so you can imagine how loud that car is so um, this is another buddy of mine that is immaculate E30 absolutely stunning so like I said guys, the original E33 to 5i, gonna get a start up. It's just gonna move the car though, nothing crazy. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, gonna love that sound. But yeah, you don't find them like this anymore guys. You don't find them like this at all. And when you do, you have to sell your house in order to buy it. <laughs> <laughs> at the prices they go in for these days absolutely beautiful we got the IS over there the perfect pair and got the Yaris GR that thing sounds absolutely insane beauty the M4 I have to hear still but uh, hopefully we'll catch them all on the run <laughs> Porsche is sounding good. Got the Porsche GT4 and the BM pulling up. Oh, Ooh, what a color on the GT4. Oh, oh, oh. Absolutely stunning spec. And it's parked next to another Porsche. Awesome bunch of cars that's coming out today. So uh, I'm with the GT4 now. Look at this color on this car, guys. Absolutely stunning. Owner said I can check it out. And this is the interior to get to the GT4 so so cool have a look at these seats i'm going to show you in a moment just going to make sure no one bumps this door i don't have enough subscribers to pay for this yet <laughs> and yeah we got clocks that rev to 9000 rpm it's not just the vtex guys the porsches can do it too but uh yeah like i say we've got a very small cockpit but uh, the owner says there's more than enough space to do what you need to do i'm sure it feels amazing so as you can see this one's now caught all the attention this color is absolutely stunning i really hope the camera does it justice we are riding on what size is this i assume 20s let me find it let me find it yep there we go 245 55 20s really like the design of this rim but uh, what gets me the most is this color it really does this car justice and got the awesome wing at the back the time has come we are now leaving um gonna make our way to the road i'll join them for a bit like i said but i'm not doing the whole run here comes this audi get this for you guys audi and the one series let me jump on my bike rather because they are going to leave me behind absolutely stunning so yeah 
yeah, the meetup spot was Jared's. Thanks to Jared for being an awesome host, allowing the guys to come here. No one overperformed, no one went raucous, everyone obeyed the rules. Oh, the two E30s. But um, you want to respect the rules when people request you to do those, to not do those things. <laughs> GT4, absolute beauty. So I'm going to catch up with the pack ahead. We got the Z4 over here, 440i. There goes the M4. I want to see if I can catch that M4 for some exhaust notes. Yaris GR. Thank you. <laughs> 140i, this is gonna be a symphony up ahead. Got the 140i, got the M4. There's a Sirocco in the mix. And amazing weather and some open roads. Look at these views, absolutely stunning. Let's not slip, I don't want to be that guy. <laughs> Sirocco We got the 235 i on aftermarket wheels Looking so good I love this wing on this Audi M4 up ahead I just love this backdrop I feel as, I feel as if I'm watching a cinematic Got the GR behind me. This Porsche sounds good, and that's the lead car up again, up ahead. The C200. GR. I'm sure we're gonna see some other beauties here in uh, C Point Main Road. That Yaris is moving. Jeez, it's so unexpected from a Yaris. You see it squat, and next thing it's gone. Wolf in sheep's clothing, my guys. Wolf in sheep's clothing. Check it. Look at it go. Look at it go. And he is gone. I don't want to actually push it in this road because I might just end up seeing blue lights in my rearview mirror. See if I can catch him at the, the robot. There we go. It's about to go down. What a stunner, man. I love these GR models. Toyota is really stepping up the game. GR4. Don't let that Yaris badge fool you guys. I'm sure you guys know about this already. Goodness, look at that thing hugs the corner. That thing is going to do damage on the pass. And he's gone. There's no way. I stood no chance. To the driver of the Yaris. Nope. Even if I went for it. Around those bends, it sticks like glue. Absolutely amazing to see in action. I'm sorry I couldn't get closer for you guys. But uh put off on the side of the road. The Yaris was too fast for me guys. I gave up. <laughs> Just catch the guys in convoy coming past, got the C-Class And the rest of the guys Look at this IS and this E30 Crazy, 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 crazy Let's see if I can get some rollers for you guys at the back of the pack gatekeeping respect your outers people respect your outers trying to 
find where the GT4 is. We got the 718 Cayman. And the immaculate original E33 to 5i. How often do you get to see something like this on the road guys? And you get to see the owner enjoying it as well. Taking it easy, getting out of town, Z4. But I'm sure soon enough you're gonna hear some of these cars scream. I wanna get this Audi, this Audi's a monster. You have to hear the dump on this thing. Oh. Two, three, five, I sounding absolutely lovely. You can just hear the turbos pulling up and the bubbles. And we have a robot. This is always exciting when you're on a run. Stop completely, have the pack catch up. And are we going? fun jeez like I can't explain how rapid that Yaris is it's unbelievable look I never use the excuse of I'm on a 600 and um, a thousand would do better at the end of the day a 600 cc is fast for what it is and to have something way heavier on four wheels um, perform like that with a bike on the road is absolutely mental that was fun I'm awake I can probably stay awake till tomorrow with the way the adrenaline is pumping but uh, yeah that was so cool epic epic drive from the Yaris 
guy can really handle the road well and like I said I stood no chance on those bends <laughs> absolutely crazy hi guys that's it from me for this morning's run if you've made it this far I really appreciate it thank you for watching all the way to the end thank you for all the support it's been amazing uh, this channel is less than a year old and I've received crazy support from you all on all my platforms and I really appreciate it and uh, next time I'll hopefully be able to do a full run thank you for watching I will make sure it's charged properly next time thank you so so much until the next one